Now I'm going to show you how to do daily maintenance on your L1800 DTF printer. These are the items we're going to be using today to help with the maintenance. We have swabs, cleaning cloths, alcohol cleaning, and an extra waste ink container. Check the waste ink container and replace it in time. Now I'm going to switch on the power button in the back of the printer and then I will press the power button on the front of the printer. Then we'll wait for it to boot up. Now I'm going to press and hold the ink button for five seconds. And then I will move the print head over. And turn off the power. Now I'm going to move the print head all the way to the left and the first step is to clean the encode stripe. You're going to take your cleaning cloth and just rub along this stripe right here. Then you'll move the print head to the other side and wipe the other side with the cleaning cloth. Second step is cleaning the encode disk. Regular inspection of the rail rod is required. Apply lubricating oil in time if the carrier has resistance to move. Third step is cleaning the platform. Slide the print hem over and clean the left side if there's any ink on the platform. Fourth step, we're going to clean the waste ink system. Ejecting the wiper blade of the waste ink system. You're going to clean the ink on the wiper. I usually spray with alcohol and clean off the ink. After a long time, the ink will get dry and stick to the wiper. Once you're done cleaning the wiper, you're going to reset it. This is the waste pump system. I just have it here for a better view of how to flip up the wiper blade and then also to reset it back down. So this moves over just a little bit if you need it to. And then you can flip it up or you can just move it over a little bit and flip it back down. Now we're going to move the print head to the middle. I'm going to remove the paper tray because this will give me easier access to clean the actual print head underneath. So what I like to do is spray. And then you're going to put your swab all the way in there to clean around the print head.
That's really dirty. Before starting the printer, you want to make sure that the wiper head is reset. Final step is we're going to restart the printer to get the print head reset. Once it is reset, the printer will do a head cleaning. 